Truth Raider from Oregon. You're on the air. Hello, my friend. Or should I say, buenos dias, amigo? <laughs> I wouldn't Take mind if in Spanish us. they said, viva la Second Amendment. <laughs> but uh, unfortunately, uh, the, the whole invasion's CIA Ford Foundation run, so we're in deep trouble. Go ahead. Andale pues. Hey, let me take care of some minutia really quick for the callers. When the callers call in, hey, callers, when Alex picks up the line and you hear a air break, that means you're on the air. So that, that you know, clear that up for folks that call and say, hello, hello, am I on the air? <laughs> so when you hear that, well, that's also the tell them, I say, we're going to your call. Right. We're going to your but call. But listen, right this now. is what happened to any show. Most shows, even if they're local, only let like one out of three callers on. And they make sure you're listening. They make sure you're, you know, you're not, you know, wandering off. They make sure you're on topic. And then they make sure that you've, you're saying what they want to hear. I have made the decision in 19 years on air that I don't want scripted callers. And so we have a free-for-all, and it, sometimes it's great, sometimes it's bad. It's different. It's what we do. Uh, but... I do want people to have good phones, and I do want them to speak up when we go to them. But go ahead. Uh, what What do you think the next crisis is? Okay. Well, taking my improv uh, improvisation, I guess you can can say that. There, this is going to be complex, but it's going to be. I think it's going to be a mix, Alex. You're looking at uh, a stage crisis where there'll be a, an attempted nuclear attack to be blamed on Iran. It could be a medical crisis where they're going to come up with a vaccine because some type of a strain, say, for example, the Ebola virus, is coming up, and they're going to uh, offer the, the solution through through vaccinations. That's that's a, a big possibility. Uh, just a grand amount of inflation, perhaps, some type of a shortage going on and, and, and occurring. That That's a possibility. It's up in the air. Nobody can really pinpoint exactly what's going to happen. But I would say maybe those right there would be in my top three. That would be a, that. That would probably be a false flag event coming up. But undoubtedly, do you agree with me that clearly this is the season of crises, both both real, manufactured, and exacerbated, and that they are trying to destabilize the whole world right now? Oh, absolutely. I mean, it, it, it's you know, take it out of their, you know, out of their Latin terminology. They say ordo ab cao. Order out of chaos. So chaos has to be a perpetuation all the time. And that is their motto. The motto of the Illuminati, where they call them the, the, the Zionists or the Jesuits, whoever is behind it, it's a combination of all these folks. That has always been their objective, is to always have chaos all the time. So that always brings cohesion. Well, that's right. If you've got a war going on or people shooting missiles at you, then you can oppress your own population and they thank you for it. That's why many philosophers have said war is the health of the state. You are watching the best of the Alex Jones Show. Weekdays from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central. Watch live at Infowars.com forward slash show or become a member of Infowarsnews.com and help us take resistance to the next level.